All right, Bronson, you made it. You're in the Reds Hall of Fame. What's this mean? Oh, man, it uh, it means um, a place that is home, a place that I can walk into for the rest of my life. Um, you know, go into the Hall of Fame and be proud, you know, of a legacy that, I, that I've left. Um, you know, there's a lot of guys who get to play the game who leave a good legacy for their family, but they don't necessarily have a place that you could walk inside your, your kids, your grandkids, maybe your, your nieces and nephews and their kids can walk in and actually punch your name into a computer and have your, your hall of fame, you know, plaque just light up on the wall like they do here in Cincinnati. It is, you know, it's something that when, when I think about what my life means and, and does it matter if you leave anything behind, you know, a lot of times I, you know, I, I play music and a lot of times I, I tend to think that maybe five generations from now, somebody's going to listen to an album that I created long before they'll pop in a VCR tape and watch an old game that I had pitched. Right. And so to be in the Hall of Fame and to have something tangible that people could walk in from now until whenever that stadium doesn't exist anymore and really, you know, see my face light up next to guys like Adam Dunn and Eric Davis and Barry Larkin and all, all the guys that we grew up watching, um, you know, it means the world. I mean, it's 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 what you play for, right? You play for the back of your baseball card. You play for 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 the money. You you play for your teammates. You play for World Series rings. You play for getting in the Hall of Fame, and you want people to recognize you and remember you. And 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 that's what they've done, and it's been fantastic. When you look back on your career, what what's your favorite stat? I, I I'm always curious to see what guys say about this because I know that we as fans we like to talk about different things, especially with pitchers. We look at ERA, we look at the win loss record, all that different stuff. But when you look back on your career, what's your favorite stat? Well, I all my favorite stats always come in in combination, blended with my minor league stats. Right, I had 84 minor league wins, I had 1,100 minor league innings, and people don't realize what a bulk that is. I mean, that I'm like a minor league Hall of Famer, you know. And and uh, when you blend that with my big league stuff, you know, I think I I think I started 456 games from the rookie league all the way till middle of 2014 when I finally went on the disabled list with the uh, Arizona Diamondbacks. And so those 450 some odd starts um, without missing one in professional baseball is no doubt what I'm most proud of. I always wanted to be an iron man. I always wanted to pitch as many innings as I could year after year. I never wanted to not take the ball um, every fifth day. And um, you know, that got me to where I am because my skill set was not extraordinary, but my ability to run a race for a really long time was extraordinary. And, and uh, you know, that was where my ego really lied. <laughs> 